Hey guys, what's going on? It's Brian here again. I just wanted to give you another quick update on my 33 gallon marine tank. It is a, uh, a beautiful Saturday here in Calgary. Um, to say the least, there's no snow in front of our apartment and uh, yeah. Let's go take a look at uh, what's going on inside the old tanky poo. Alright. As you can see, I've added some new live rock. I've uh, made a little bit of uh, progress on my aquascaping here. Um, it's not as much rock as I want yet. I still have probably another maybe 20 more pounds to go. So slowly but surely I'll, I'll do that. As you can see as well, we have some new inhabitants with uh, John and Yoko. And um, yeah, well, I have here Fiji Blue Devil Damsels, uh, very, very pretty fish, and um, they actually change color for some reason, I don't know why, I still, I'm still researching on, on them, but it seems that when they want to hide, they can hide their blue, blue uh, color and, and disappear inside the, the rock there. Um, and as you can see, there is a mistake inside my tank, yes, a big mistake. Um, that is an Antheus, a uh, Dispar Antheus. Um, he needs a bigger tank than my 33 gallon. Um, I still don't have a net yet, so uh, for now he's going to live here until I bring him back to my local fish shop and um, find him a better home. I uh, accidentally read the, the, the description and the requirements wrong for him. He, he or she uh, needs to have at least 70 gallons to swim around and um, they don't have actually... Uh, he, uh, he's supposed to have probably about another three or four Antheus with him because they're schooling fish so uh, I made a mistake and I'm not gonna... I'm gonna try to take care of it as good as I can until I'm able to scoop him out and bring him back to my LFS and we'll see what happens there. John and Yoko seem to be enjoying the new rock as well. My pet rock is happy that it actually has some comrades to join with him. Um, the really funny thing about uh, adding my new live rock is um, there, there's brand new cured rock there. Uh, you can see uh, this bridge, this middle rock here, that rock that's there, and then there's a small rock there. Those are all brand new uh, cured rock, but um, there seem to have at my LFS a uh, an older version, <laughs> not so cured rock, and uh, it had some mushrooms on it, and I don't know where they went. So it seems like they're not uh, not thriving in my tank, or maybe even the the tr the trip kind of killed them off. Um, but this had uh, really bad hitchhikers on it called. Uh, Aptasia, yeah, they kind of like they kind of look like sea anemones, and um, they're apparently the bane of all sorts of uh, like kind of like a weed inside marine tanks. So I had to get rid of a few of them, and it may have uh, caused my my mushroom stragglers that uh, hitchhikers that came with it um, to actually die. So. Not too happy about that with the mushrooms, but that's okay. I'd rather not have um, Aptasia growing on in such a brand new tank. Uh, there is a third blue devil damsel somewhere. He is hiding though. It seems like he's more of a, a scaredy cat. The other two are pretty much um, enjoying their new home. And actually, the... This guy here seems to like like where he's at, so uh, I'm doing as much research as I can to see if, if I can even keep him or or I'm gonna have to go out and and um, find him a better home. So yeah, hopefully you guys like the new tank look. Not the greatest uh, <laughs> aquascaping yet, but that's okay. It's a whole learning curve, so we will see. All right. So that is my update for this week. Hope you guys are having a good weekend 
and uh, yeah, stay tuned for my next uh, little update on my 33 gallon marine tank. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe. My name is Brian, and this is my republic. Have a great day. Cheers.